Okay, today you are going to learn how to make a helmet, a football helmet. And this is so cool because um, I've seen designs that are uh, okay, but not, you know, like feel that I want to keep doing those designs. So I decided to re create my own design. And if someone else created, <laughs> that's great, exactly like I did. But the techniques I use, it's I go to Google and I type helmets, you know, uh, art clip or helmets cartoon so th that's easier for me to copy so every time I see them then I kind of study you know that connections and trying to make something you know easier as easier as possible because my plan is to use it as line twisting at least this design so this is what you're gonna need four balloons and we're gonna start with a 350 right or 360 the metallics I think they are 350 350 metallics this is a cool part. You can choose the colors of the team, you know, depending what they like. For example, in Cheyenne, most of the people, they like Broncos. So, uh, but I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm gonna use the colors, you know, any color, like purple for this 350. So you have to blow it all the way. And why 350? Because they are longer. And when you blow all the way the balloon, then you leave some air out and make it soft, okay? And also you stretch it. Okay, and then you start from the nozzle and make a little bubble and then go around the head of the kid. Okay, and when you go around the head of the kid, make it a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger or softer. So, okay, when you have that, then you twist it. And you're gonna actually be doing right now like a regular helmet. So you grab the end of the balloon and connect it all the way to here, to the other side. So this is a regular helmet, but the three pieces are very long and long enough or 50 or 60 what are the, 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 the metallics because the qualities are sh shorter so i guess it's a 360 right i'm not sure oh, oh, oh. Or 350, well the longest ones <laughs> of these big balloons okay so when you have this then this is what you're gonna do look my hand is like about four fingers i'm gonna measure so i measure it here see and that part i'm gonna twist it so this, we're gonna grab, you know, one of the sides. So imagine, yeah, this side so you can see. So you grab four fingers and then twist that. And then I'm gonna grab the other four fingers and twist that four fingers. So I'm gonna do it this way. So that's why it's important to be, you know, make this uh, balloon soft. And so you have this. That's gonna be in the front part. So now the part that is in the other side right here, you're gonna have to just find the middle. The middle is this part and then you twist right there. Okay? So make sure you twist it a couple of times so that thing came undone. You see, because that's the only thing. So you make sure you twist it a couple of times and everything is twist. This is what you have to have. Okay, so when you have that, you grab your three, um, your 160 balloon. Doesn't matter any color, you go with the color of the thing, you know, you're doing this helmet for. So, uh, you blow it like three or four finger without inflated, and you're gonna start attaching it right here. One of the, you know, bubbles here. So you attach it, one side. And then, you're gonna, uh, let's see. So you are here, so then you're gonna measure like six finger bubble. You see, and you're gonna make here two pinch twists. Two pinch twists and twist them really good. Okay. When you have those two pinch twists, then you go here. So with a four or five finger bubble. And then you go around. So that, while you are twisting it, you also twist, while you are put, putting around this 160, make sure you are twisting it. That's gonna help to not make undone this uh, 350 bubbles okay then you go all the other side and do the same here pass it around okay and while well, you squish and twist a couple times so that thing came and down that's gonna secure your balloon so when you have that you go like how many bubbles uh five finger bubble first mm -hmm. and then you make two pinch twists so now you have this choice go here and connect these two together like this or go here you know this side so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to um go let's see what to do what to do 
Okay, I'm going this way. I'm making it a little bit different than I've been doing it because I created this design for um, my family fun night at Texas Road House. So it went really good. Everybody likes the helmets, the kids and the tools. And um, I feel like, okay, this is a nice design. I should teach, you know, show, you know, what I did because it works really good for me. So make sure this is tight, you know, and secure. Okay, when you have that, now you're going with your second 160 uh, balloon that is blowing with four finger tail. Okay, so when you have that, you're going to now connect these pinch twists here. These two pinch twists are going to connect with these two pinch twists. Um, so how much space there? Because that's going to be the window where the kids are going to be able to see. So we're going with like 10 finger bubble, okay? I think that's gonna be okay. Ten or nine finger bubble. Let me see when I close it, I'm gonna count it. So, yeah, it's like a nine finger bubble, that bu this bubble. Okay, when you have that, you actually are going back, but this time find the center of this one, okay? And make sure you twist it and make a small pinch twist. And then you go and close it again. Now, from here, you actually are going down. So you're going down with just four finger bubble. It's gonna, then you go here three finger bubble, a pinch twist here, okay? Then a two or oh, three finger bubble again, another pinch twist. And now look, this part is gonna be the one that you're gonna count eight fingers and go all the way to this place. This pinch twist, little pinch twist you made, okay? And you then have to go back. So make sure you twist it a couple of times there so it doesn't come undone. And now you are coming back, but where? You're going back with an eight finger bubble to this pinch twist, you see? So now when you have that, the idea is to go back. So with the rest of the balloon, go back to the other pinch twist. So here is like a double bubble. And then here, three finger bubble. And then you go back with a four finger bubble. So you're gonna have enough balloon, but be careful. So maybe you leave, you know, like five finger tail. So then you have enough space and you're not, you know, worried that if you pinch this, it's gonna pop. And that's gonna be scary because it's very tight. So I'm gonna do my best here. I'm gonna make sure I pop this balloon very carefully. Oh, I did it, I did it, Ooh, I did it. So I'm going to oh, make sure this doesn't come undone before it's too late. So so this part, I'm just gonna touch it all the way to the two pinch twists, okay? So I'm gonna make sure I have here like a small twist. So this is what you have so far. I'm gonna show you, it's, let's see, you have this. So um, what you have to do now, and this is the thing, it's this four eight finger bubble we did here, you have to bend it. So then that way it's gonna kind of like, you know, look more bended, you know, and it's gonna have this shape now. You, you can see that, yeah. Okay, so now you kind of like play with the twist. So you put one pinch twist in the front, one pinch twist and the back and you have that so this is super cool because it's like looks like a helmet already and it's not done yet <laughs> now you're gonna grab one 260 and you inflate it leaving like one finger tail because you're gonna usually I think you're gonna use all the balloons so this is what you do you start from the um, from the back side and you make here a, a bubble and connect it to this back side okay so when you have that, then you go all the way here down. And here, look, remember this bubble? You you can do this and it's gonna be okay. Look, you just go all the way here and go with a pinch twist. You see, and put it right here and it can get stuck. But if you feel like, oh, it's not gonna stay there, you can twist this bubble, you know, and that's gonna kind of like make it stay there. Okay, then you go with the rest of the balloon all the way back to this bubble and close it. And you know, connect it all together 
because it's a back side, you can leave this here or you can cut the bubbles, you can tie it. Um, in my case, for example, I'm going to cut it, you see, and twist it a couple times and, and tie it all here and do a pinch twist here. So that's kind of ends. And this is how, let me take off my glasses, because with glasses, you know, be careful when you put this helmet into a kit. You know, so you just put it like the front head goes this part, this part, and you just, um, you know, wear it like a regular helmet. Look, it's amazing. I love this design, you see? And it was really cool how it looks, you know, from the front part, from the back part, sides, you know, and I hope you like it. Okay, bye bye.